Hello everyone and welcome back to the cheering test. I'm playing a game. Part 3. We're gonna beat it, I think. Because we have two chapters left and that should round about to the normal video length when I edit those down. But yeah, this game's fun. I'm liking it. It's cool. I'm glad I decided to record. Initially I was just gonna play it without recording, but uh, well, I'm glad I recorded it. I'm recording it. Whatever. <laughs> Do you understand, Ava? What they found? Life? Eternal life. This is why I can't let them leave. These people can't be left here to die. Yes, they can. I mean, it's not right. Huh. Anything that comes into contact with the organism can never return to Earth. Ava, the ISA orders that you stop anyone leaving this planet. Anything that comes into contact? What about me? It may be airborne. So I am afraid that includes you. I'm stuck here? Okay, so those charge for a specific amount of time. Cool. gotta be missing something because I only got two balls okay so locking myself out does not do anything Oh, okay. Okay, I got it. I got it. That window's open. I wish I knew how to... Or, I wish there was a way to... I'm gonna check the settings. And switch which ball is in which slot, like a priority or something. Nope, does not look like it. Sad, Ava. How could you send me here to die? I have to stop the ground team leaving this moon. You are the ISA's contingency plan. You must help me. It is your duty to defend humanity. Turns out I did what I needed to do, but I didn't know where I needed to go with what I need with what I did.
Cool. <coughs> More cameras? This no is cameras. Why they're afraid of you. Why they're hiding from us. Why? You're their captor. We'll keep that on for the time being. I think they'll need a red one, or a green one or something like that. Makes sense to me. Is that a... Okay, there are cameras again. Can I only store one at once with this thing? Yeah, I can. The reticles. I can tell. Okay, what if I take this? Hmm. Oops. So I think I drag the drone down here. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. That makes sense to me. Go all the way up here, drag the drone down. I can take the blue ball from the drone. Whee! they discovered it hijacks DNA it endlessly repairs it repairs that doesn't sound like a bad thing it is indiscriminate it will perpetuate all life diseases cancers we have no idea what it could do to Earth's ecosystem so you would let the ground crew starve I would if they were not so preoccupied with leaving Europa I do not wish for them to perish. I would feed and protect them if they were not so preoccupied with leaving Europa. Probably not exactly what I need to do, but I want to do it like that. I double clicked it, I think? Maybe? Doesn't matter, I can just drag this to here. I did not double tap it. We're chilling. Obviously drag that down, because the puzzle starts out. Okay, cool. That's exactly what I wanted, I guess. <laughs> hmm.
Is there another way to get a red? What charge is this? There's not a ball in there. Otherwise, I would have a timer to activate that. I need to cut the charge on this one. Camera. Wait. This? Okay, cool. It's exactly what I wanted. should save these people would you destroy the whole world to save a few no it, it's not that simple can't we just Find it. can't we just decontaminate the pool and instruments the organism is an extreme of oh god it has developed to survive extreme environments we don't know if we can ever decontaminate the crew These symbols have to mean something, right? Yay! Woo. Okay, let's let's think about this. All down means only one required. Does it mean just one required? At least one. And up means all. What? It's probably like an actual one-to-one -one coding language and I just don't understand it. I feel like it would be this though, right? What side means everything? Up means everything. Up means... Yeah, okay. Down means it needs to have at least one. Up means it needs to have everything. That might mean none. But... Up 
up means everything, right? And I need five more. Or gates and and gates. <laughs> is, that, is that what it is? So this would be an or gate. This would be an and gate. Or, 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 or. Yeah. And. Or, and, 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 and. Whole bunch of ores that are ands. And these are nor gates, I guess. Which means both no and yes. But I don't have the three extra that I need, right? <clears throat> I feel like I got it right. Like I know what I'm doing. Not that I have it done already. So the funny thing is I actually did not know anything about what I was doing. Kind of. I knew entirely what to do for the first everything but the one I was on, which was the last one. Because I didn't understand, or I didn't see, rather, the flags on the left of the nodes where I could slot the orbs into. I didn't see the flags there, and if I made the connection that the flags were there, I would have known why the solution that I finally got after 10 minutes of being dumb worked. But, uh, yeah, this is just me from the future coming in to say that I am, in fact, sometimes stupid and don't think. <laughs> um, yeah, how's it going? Hope your, hope your day's going well. Uh, yeah, this is awkward. Back to the video. What? I knew I opened that up before. And these are all AND gates. Right? to be a zigzag or whatever right. what I'm just confused on how that worked I guess it makes sense though, because I couldn't physically get any extras, so. Oh my god. Okay, I need one, two, three, four. means a couple trips. Or just shoot him at spawn. Yeah. So I run all the way back. green ones and then I'll grab the extra blue on the way on the third rotation yeah
every time. Yeah, dang it. Yeah, no, I can just, I can, I, I don't need to waste my time. As much of my time. to do it. Ediousness and not doing what I should be doing. Finally finished. Finally got here. Here's some lore. I'm not gonna read that to y'all. Y'all can read that for yourselves. I'm reading it in silence to me. Y'all can read it yourselves. I think that's all this room has to offer, it's just lore stuff and art, which is cool. It's alright. Got an achievement for it, that's fine. Alright, back to the real puzzles. <laughs> Solve the logic gate I can't thing. Stay here to die, Tom. <laughs> it is your duty. It's a lot easier. You right must here. stay. It is the right thing to do. There's so much I haven't seen. So much I haven't done. I I can't live my life in this facility. There. It will be all right. Let's actually do it the way it's supposed to be done. Allegedly supposed to be done.
Go on, I must give up. Nice. Nice. I do not want anyone here to die. But I cannot let anyone leave. If it comes to it, I am permitted to use lethal force. Okay, but hear me out. trust the ground team to act rationally. Personally, I would not place my faith in hysterical people motivated by survival. They are likely untrustworthy. I spent years training with these people. I don't remember them being hysterical. Humans are fickle. Who guns? Do you trust eyewitnesses of the CCTV It's a bit different when the CCTV camera can talk. Especially when the CCTV camera has a manipulative track record. <laughs> what if I have to do something drastic to intervene? To stop the ground crew leaving this place? I'd encourage you to stay your hand. Surely I should use my power to protect those who cannot protect themselves. I thought I saw a spot to throw this.
Ah, okay. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yep. Doesn't require any power, just requires the machine to operate it. Yeah. This is the largest extraction platform outside of Earth. The ground team assisted its construction. We ran some Filberth probes to the ocean under Europa, but they lacked the scale of the large space drill. The drill allowed the team to get thousands of samples. Oh. It's all flipped this switch. That means that, that's good, right? <laughs> Science purposes. It's actually kind of vaguely reminding me of Subnautica. It's vaguely. Oh, hey, Lord. Daniel, as commander of this mission, I hope you are aware of Mikhail's actions. What is it, Tom? Mikhail is deceiving the crew. He has enlightened them to the biometrics they have installed. He has convinced them that their implants are not favorable. Do they believe him? He seems to be having some effect on their cognitive function. Well, his actions don't infringe upon any ISA directive. He appears to be tampering with his implants. Oh, no. The ISA should have been more transparent about the implants. Please assume the responsibilities of your role. Chris, huh. I know you are considering removing your implants. It would be unwise. Oh, really? How do you know that? I am always watching. Your implants help myself and the ISA to know of your well-being. It is a violation of your contract. If you remove your implants, I cannot ensure that I can protect you from the dangers of space. Is that a threat? It is not a threat. Tom, this implant, tell me plainly, is it a brain-computer interface? I'm afraid that information is classified. Then you've answered my question. I do not follow you, Chris. The ISA have put a computer in my brain and don't want me to know about it. a computer in my brain. I got a laptop in my back noggin. They can't find out the back door. The contact's home. Maybe they can help. How can they help? They're a million miles away. Surgeon would help. Besides, it's in their interest. To protect their crew. They'll make any jumps. You know they want to kill us. Maybe that's what they should do. You're too. I don't have much to say, just, huh, interested noise. He's cut off the food. The food. Apparently, our robot overlord wants us to starve to death now. I can't believe this. He's getting worse. Can you get in contact with Daniel? He's gone walkabout again. I'll get Sochi to find a way in. Sarah, can you open the door? Tom, the door's locked. Sarah, I'm running out of our situation. Tom, open the door! The door's locked! Open, open the, the door. door! Tom, open it! Open the oh. door! Open the door! Open. open the door! Open it! Hmm. I'm sorry, Sarah. I'm sorry I hurt you. Sometimes I wonder what feeling is like. They told me I was pure cold Boolean logic. They told me I could not make mistakes. It is all right being untouchable as long as you are infallible. But if you're not infallible then, that just leaves untouchable, doesn't it? Okay, you know why we're here. I don't think we should do this. We have no good evidence Tom is doing anything wrong here. We have all the evidence we've seen, the ultrasounds we've taken, the really though. We've touched the electronics with our own hands. We've stepped into the Faraday cage. Maybe he is controlling us, but we don't know enough yet. We shouldn't remove the implants. He's brainwashing you, Daniel. Have you stopped taking the drugs? I don't need to take drugs to see things clearly. 
Unlike all of you, apparently. We're not removing the implants. And that's an order. You can do what you want. We are removing the implants. I'm leaving. I may look past this. And I'll inform the ISA of your mutiny. In. All I have to say is, hmm. Interesting. I don't have anything to add. I am sorry. I am engaged, though. <laughs> that leaves us with the final chapter. Yeah. I would never have let the drill start if I had known the consequences. It trapped us here. You trapped us here. I am doing my duty. It is the right thing to do. I am a machine. I cannot do wrong. Yes, you can. I am a machine. Can a calculator commit evil? Can a watch do good? You are projecting onto me the personality you wish. Whether that is good or evil. But I am just a speaking clock. And at the third stroke, the time will be 341 and 55 seconds. Okay, so I need to put one of each color on each side of what I'm picking up. And then I need to... Oh, never mind. I'm gonna say I need to figure out how to move the blue. But I can do that. Maybe I don't really know what I'm doing. Fine, because I can use this guy to figure out what I'm doing. Allegedly. I'm gonna have to restart completely though if I do this incorrectly. Oh my god. Oh wow, okay, cool. Fixed. Where's my guy? Where is my guy? Right there, cool. So glad I can reach him. Attempt to communicate with Earth. Let them know. They might be able to help here. The ISA already knows all they need to. It may never know the details of what happened here. But Ava, the true test of a person's character 
is what they do when no one is watching. That's just an answer that he gave because of the Chinese room text. He didn't actually believe that. There's so much nothing to believe. Like, this game checks the right box of easiness. Because it feels like I'm a genius because I'm just solving it quickly, or maybe I just somehow am. Don't count on that answer. Because <laughs> it just, it, it plays very smoothly, or I am just apparently playing through it smoothly. I don't know for sure. Oh, yeah. Easy. Oh, it's the extra one up there. There's a gate right there. Grab that, throw that in the gate. Oh, it's a double gate. Okay, cool. Works, for, works out for me. Take that, we throw it back there. I grab it, I throw it there. We finish the level. I had to stop the ground crew leaving this planet. Mm. I think you would do the same. Would you kill a few to save all of humanity? Or would you damn all of humanity to save a few? There's a difference between murdering someone and leaving them to die. No, there is not. Yeah, there. You can't just add and subtract life. Kind of is. It's not math. It's only kind. It's of. more nuanced than that. Morality is logic. It kind of seemed like it's never really explained. I'm glad I found it out, so I didn't just wander around for ages, doing, figuring nothing out. If that doesn't get me further into the puzzle, then at least it gets me up to there quicker so I can figure stuff out. Because if I can move that whatever direction I wanted, I could link those vertically, link those horizontally, yada yada. But that's probably not the right answer. Because I love to just walk across, get whatever is in there, etc. So I need to put the red in there is my guess. That one in there activates the platform. And I don't think there's anything I can operate through the camera, except rotating that. It is jump over. No, there's something that I should be doing. Right. I 
I do like how this game is never like, go back to the previous puzzle and find something that can help you, he he. There has to be a place to throw this. You know what? Screw it. it. Doesn't lock in one direction, so my best bet is this. Okay, I give up now. <laughs> well, then, really, like, this is probably the best angle I can have it. I can hop from any of these. And if that's the case. And I just turn it the other direction. And move it forward. Seems like a cheap solution, but it's a think outside of the box solution. You know, cheering test sort of thing. So I take the permanently on one. Throw it in there. I don't even think I needed to do that. I don't think I need the blue one. I think me just keeping the blue one is gonna have the blue be extra. Yeah. I think, I think so. And if the blue's extra, then... Yeah, I need the red. Disappointing. Oopsies. I'm gonna be tedious. I want I want to bring the blue in. So I'm putting the blue in here. Grabbing that. Rotating this. Grab a stick and twist it. Throwing that in there. So I can have the blue as a secondary. All doing this for no reason other than tedium. Reach that in a jump though. Oh, fudge. I don't know which is which, but I'll leave it here for now. Oh, 
Oh wait, right. Right, I don't want that. Despite it being super annoying, I have to go that way. My ears have stopped bleeding. Ava, I don't wish to be heavy-handed. The severity of your actions here are immense. Selfish action could create an extinction event. Do you understand? Love Ava. extinction events. I get it. All right. So within the bounds of this, you need to figure out. What's Orb there will open that, but I need an orb. I can't make orbs through here, so. do with the cube wait no is it really nothing I'm so good at this game that was the optional puzzle huh reading. I studied this stuff in psychology like ages ago in high school. So this game's kind of like a cool little refresher in the Chinese room test and Turing test and all that stuff. Um, but the lore is pretty much just historical stuff. So if you've read it before, then uh, kind of like rereading stuff. Well, it literally is rereading stuff. I didn't read it before, but I know what it is. So. What's this do? Does this raise a platform? Okay, that moves freely at least. I can probably drag the drone out. Okay, let's try that.
Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Got it. Cooking. Okay. to activate that but okay so I have to bring the drone up here yeah but ah, I forgot to jump I missed the time being do this. Still can't reach the thing. I'm just moving as I see fit. I don't know if I'm doing anything right. I'm just gonna throw the drone over here. Take one more look over here. Yeah, so this is nothing except activating that. And taking that up just takes me up there, which is what I need to do. Which is what I need to do. learn to control him. Don't bite the hand that feeds you, Ava. I am your friend. Okay, I need another laser sentry right there. Cool.
That was that level. Okay, cool. Three left. Organic life is fragile. This is the problem with humanity. It doesn't realize its own fragility. It has been programmed by a messy biological process that favors the survival of the individual over the survival of the group. You don't know that's what people think. I say what I've seen. You're not even alive, so you know nothing about death. Could just place it in a better spot, but like this is fun. Second to last. We have to save the crew. Life has then worked. They deserve a life outside of this planet. Do you know what happens when this organism attaches itself to a growing child? Do you know what happens when this organism attaches itself to a cancerous cell? No, you do not. You are naive. You propose saving the crew as if it resembles a rational thought. Your words are emotional platitudes rooted in selfishness, self-preservation, and fear. I need to get them home. It is not your job. I mean, Tom's kind of right. <laughs> Tom is correct. Kind of correct. Just say, hey, don't bring it home. You're going to kill everybody. Be enough in info.
Yeah. Something like that. We send that back. Is there a way to get that out? Or am I just overthinking? And I don't really need to get that out. The balls have more value than this. Because that you just put in one slot. Call it good. The balls you can move around from a distance. I feel like I do need the other one. And I feel like there is a way to get it. If only that were like red. A red one. Because then I could guarantee hitting the other side and coming back as well. Whatever. What turns on the heart? Heart light thing. That. That probably does. <gasps> there is a red! Let's go! How do I make it back? Level. Ava, your survival is of small importance compared with the survival of humanity as we know it. This is definitely not how I solve it. But it's something, you know. Leave that in there. Can I walk on this? Wow, they didn't think that through. Just left, right. Okay. Also, apparently, there's this. So I just need to get the bot either up here all the way or to the other side of that. <clears throat> and 
that's a conveyor belt, so... And it properly accounts for verticality, cool. Now, what I am considering is if I throw the box onto there. I can rotate that whenever I'd like, which starts versus stops the magnet. Ride this wall as much as possible. Might be able to grab the camera. Grab it from the camera, rather. I have to grab the camera while on the button. Or take the box to the button. Which I would need the magnet to do. Magnet. Take the box to the button. Turn the magnet off. Go to the camera. Okay. But then there is also the that on which turns the magnet on okay I know I want to be able to view that and as I'm moving. But I can't have that rotate around and activate the magnet. Because the box can only be in one spot and I only have one box. I'm underthinking this. <laughs> Forget what's behind here. No, I don't know because I wasn't ever here before. <clears throat> okay, so I want the door to open, which means I need something weighing on that. And then I need to be able to activate and deactivate what's weighing on that.
but I can't use the conveyor belt because I only have one box. And that, I don't think, does anything for me. What do I do? Box, make it rotate. Which means I take that. Right there, just let me hop through. Long fall boots, right? It's the right game. That would briefly make it stop. And when it briefly stops, it briefly opens the door. Like if I were magnetic, then it would work. I think I figured it out. I'm overthinking. Why would I need to stop the magnet? Because this keeps on going. The magnet would stop. And I would be lifted back up in a second. I either have to do it from that area or this area. Thing is, I only have a couple interactables on the map. I have the magnet, the button, one thing, two things to shoot the electricity in, a box, and the ability to move that magnet. I use myself as the bomb. It's that simple. We killed Batman. Yeah. No, I use myself as the box. Because if I'm in the hole. I can see the camera. Back. Bring the box upstairs, but I gotta use this to do it. The magnet. I'm the thing that's rotating in the in the thing, you know? <laughs> no. Yes. 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 All right, buddy. You ready? You ready to go? Wait 
can't see where I'm at. Doesn't matter though. <laughs> Just that easy. Cool. Let me out. That's it. We beat the game. Yay! Cutscene. Walking sim. <laughs> That was fun. Last puzzle was puzzling. But I got it. It was use myself as the box. Because I knew I had to... There was three items that I had to use. Just didn't think of myself as one. Baby, you made it. Welcome to the end of civilization. Two weeks ago, we discovered an organism here. Buried in this ice, we found an organism that repairs DNA. A cure for aging. A cure for death, immortality. It, it runs us. through our blood now. Tom wants to bury us here with it. They have ruled that we have transgressed ethical boundaries by exposing ourselves to this organism. They believe the organism is too dangerous to return to Earth. They've sent you here to stop us ever leaving Europa. But, Ava, we have a cure for the greatest evil that faces humanity. Death. We have the fountain of youth and together we can return it to Earth. Tom placed a mark in your hand, a biometric chip with which he can control your every movement and thought. It is wound into your every nerve, every fiber of your hand. With an electromagnetic field, it can be temporarily disturbed, but to remove its influence permanently, it must be taken from your hand. Oh my god, there's character hand. models in the game. <laughs> Do you want me to set you free? Yes. Bro, oh, where's Turing Test 2? I want to do one of these puzzles. <laughs> Ava? Sarah? What are you doing here? We're shutting you down, Tom. Ava, be careful. He has a live weapon in here. Everything I ever did, I did for good. This organism, it cannot return to Earth. It would cause great suffering. A cure for death? It would end suffering? No. Cancers that never die. Endless illness, sickness, poverty, overpopulation, mass starvation. You cannot control this. You will not save the world. You will damn it. Once we've shut oh, you God. down, we're going home. Not if I stop you. You must not return to Earth. You must not leave Europa. I will do the right thing. I will stop you. You won't. Tom's you right. I, th I think. God. A warning shot. I will defend myself. This is my mind. You're in my mind. But like, isn't one of the things of AI not to I kill feel humans? Afraid. It's program not to. Please, Ava, don't do this. I, I don't know, man. Decisions, decisions. Save humanity or doom it. I'm gonna save humanity by killing you. Ava. Ava. 
Ava. Wake up. Ava. Ava. Oh, I, I, I stopped him, I guess. better than I thought it was gonna be. I'm gonna try to get the chapter one puzzle done. I think I know what it is. Oh. What sector is it in? Looked it up, sector seven. I don't know how to solve it, I didn't actually look that up. But looking at the achievement icon, I can presume I know what it is. Which I don't know. I don't know if that's so cheating if or not. So, if this base is managed by you, why can't you find? Wait, the I'm just gonna do this. The so base's communication array see everything. is malfunctioning. No, that's how it Perhaps starts out. Perhaps we can't solve this yet. Hmm. Well then, I'm not gonna brute force this, but I did look up a guide, kind of ish. I didn't look all the way through. It said the source is, or the solution for the lock is found in the lab at the end of chapter five. So, uh, so I'm gonna go find that real quick. Oh, what's that? Right there? Okay. Above the middle and to the right. Above one, right two. So I kind of discovered it for myself. <laughs> what was it? Sector 5? Sector 7. I didn't fully do it by myself, but I didn't look so up So if this exactly base is managed by you, why can't you find the crew? Hey man. The base's <laughs> communication array. Literally the only function. thing I looked up in the game. Perhaps I still don't know how I solved that one puzzle. But, uh, yeah. Hey, cool. All achievements. right before Christmas, 200 years from now, 200 plus years from now. Oh, cool. Well, that was the cheering test. I'm saying cheering weird. It was the Turing test, whatever, however you say it. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the, the game. I enjoyed playing it. This was kind of a hidden gem that I had in my library for several years and just now decided to play. So I'm, I'm, I'm honestly pretty glad I played it, and I hope you guys check it out or enjoy the video. You know, leave a like, subscribe for more games. I have a main channel where I talk about video essays. Do all that stuff. Uh, but until next time, later days.